boom what's going on everybody my name is Curse Crocodile and welcome back to the channel today we are playing some more Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 if you're excited for this stream make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up subscribe to the channel around here because uh, uh, we play games and we have a load of fun and as always so hit the notification bell so you never miss a video and as always, thank you guys so much for all the support on the last two or three uh, streams that I have done on this channel. It's been greatly appreciated. The likes, shares, comments, even the subscriptions, uh, you guys subscribing to the channel have been amazing recently. So thank you so much for everyone who's came over to any of my streams, said hello. And even if you do give me feedback and hit the dislike button, let me know why you hit the dislike button in the comment section below. As always, um, yeah, let me know how I can improve these streams for your entertainment and viewing purposes. So... I literally just streamed like half an hour of what I wanted to do. Um, a little bit of footage was lost. Uh, the main goal for today, though, which was in the like the same goal was uh, literally the same goal was in. Oh, okay, I thought there was something there. Uh, but yeah, the main goal for today is to try and get this uh, agent pea shooter up to level uh, level ten. I literally just recorded like 20 minutes of footage and it disconnected. So uh, that's something you'll never see. Is the, is the uh, that footage which is really really annoying but yeah we're going to go to the community challenge for those who don't know what community challenge is basically challenges every single week uh, that the developers bring out on the game and everyone on that platform comes together and helps each other out so as you can see this week is revives we have to just get a load of revives I've done my part already I could participate more but I'm not going to focus on it entirely uh, as you can see we nearly got the 1 million wondrous pack of greatness uh, we're on 960,485 revives at the moment which is a lot uh, it's a big number especially for revives if that was kills then yeah I would understand but revives that just seems a load for me rip that stream I know it's really annoying that that connection problem I have no idea what it was it's just I apologize I really am apologizing for that that was just stupid I have no idea why it was lagging if it does happen again, then I'm going to have to try and figure something out, but I have no idea. But yeah, um, yeah, when we get this guy to level 10, we're going to come back here in the backyard battleground. This amazing place, which I pretty much might as well call my second home. And then we're going to go into this place over there uh, on the plus side to prestigious guy to first prestige. Underneath this amazing tree house, looking fantastic as always. Look at it, it looks, it looks majestic. Look at those little bird houses, got the windows. Anyway, let's stop talking about the tree house. Um, and we're going to jump straight into some turf takeover bit. But yeah, thank you so much for everyone who's came over to the last couple of streams. It's been absolutely amazing. It's been a, a blast playing this game as always for you guys. Like literally, support has been incredible. Um, but yeah, like I said, I literally just recorded like 20 minutes of this and it disconnected. So thank you everyone who's came back over to the stream. I apologise. We're live on YouTube right now, guys. Um, www youtube.com forward slash curse crocodile check me out i play a load of different games on the channel i play plants vs zombies garden warfare 2 which i'm playing right now we play sims 4 we play the h1z1 battle royale type of games uh, fortnite as well i play a load of different games so yeah there's going to be quite a few different games along the way hopefully um they should be around anytime soon red dead redemption 2 is going to be fun to play on the channel quite a few people want to see that so um, I'm going to try and take out these robots here because that's what you normally have to do on this map. Really, really annoying because they actually do a load of damage. For CPUs, it may sound weird, but these two CPU robot things actually do a lot of damage to you early on game. And as soon as you run in there with like 10% health, you're dead already. So, yeah. Uh, wait, we've got some action going on down here already. I have no idea why they're right here with us, but... I'm going to go on the left-hand side. I don't know where the Rose is. Um, I don't know where the Teleporter is. I think... Is it, yeah, it's the left hand side here, which is actually interesting. We've got a couple of roses on our team, which is uh, which is good. We need variety, we need to have some... Uh, well, we need to have variety on the team in order to try and make the best plans possible. So, that's the way I look at it. If we have more characters and different types of characters on the team, um, uh, the better. So, looks like this paleontologist... <laughs> He tried to throw a sticky grenade at me and hit the lamppost. <laughs> that didn't work, dude. Uh, where, where are, where is everyone? Okay, so we've got a couple of all stars in there. Imagine we get rid of the shield because I'm gonna get this guy. Out. Am I hitting him? Uh, got an assist. Really? After all that, I get an assist. But yeah, I'm actually gonna sit on top of this roof here. It's actually a pretty good spot. Um, I normally sit on this roof, 
on this map. It's actually, you get a good overview of... Oh, Jesus, that guy. Frankenstein 240. <laughs> he, literally just, he literally scared me there. I just see a massive, like, colourful glow next to... Oh, yeah, we've got, we got a Z-Mech along the way. I'm going to have to try and get rid of this guy. I'm going to turn into my P Gatling and just spray at him. Just a load of damage. There we go. Didn't even stand a chance. All right, mister. Mr. Paleontologist, please go away. You're going to be a pain. You're actually hurting me. I'm dead. <laughs> Lucky guy. 4% health. Are you serious? Every time on any, any, literally, hear me out. On every other game I play, I swear I always get so close to killing that person, like the enemies, any person I'm facing. It's like I would buy like 1 or 2% health. <laughs> and I'm just like, seriously, you do that to me like that. All right, look, oh yeah, one second, we're going to kill this foot soldier. He's actually, there we go. Eric. Killed Eric right there. <laughs> Wait, what is there? Why is there a sniper at the back? Wait, Mr. Captain Flameface. Wait, here we go, we've got a power. Up. Get rid of this stupid thing. There we go. Honestly, the pilots are, like, invincible, I swear. The amount of times I shoot at them and they don't die, like, instantly. Why is this foot soldier here again? Go away. I'm actually getting shot by this. Oh, right. How did an all star get up there? I'm sorry, but how did that? How is that even possible? All right, I'm gonna get me revive. I've got you, bro. I'm gonna revive you. Oh no, there's a Z mech. There's a Z mech. Oh no, 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 no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Thank you. No, jump on top of the roof. That'd be great. Thank you. <laughs> there's a hover goat. Oh, excuse me, Mr. Hover Goat. What are you doing down there? Get out of here. I don't know why I threw that beam bomb, but. There we go, got an assist for that, really? After all that, I get an assist. Again, it's either I don't get a kill or I get an assist. It's always been like that. Oh, this paleontologist, I swear this guy is actually really annoying me right now. Again, fire damage, honestly, right. My favourite element in the game, 2% health, probably has to be um, fire damage. Yeah, fire damage is more than likely my favourite variant uh just purely because it, it's just op in my opinion especially when i'm captain flame face i think his name is it just works out so well <laughs> again is it the same guy in it rt gamer okay this actually, this guy is actually normal he's on nine kills magic viking he was in my stream yesterday we got super duke we got kawaii we got eliwick hey eliwick's on my team right now ksjd2 shetland uh, Eric on their team, got Brian, got a load of different people, probably from different countries, I, for those who don't know, I am from United Kingdom, England, I know, nothing too fancy to be fair, anyone who's looking to go to England, it's not actually that good, pretty much like uh, America, just, I don't know, less fun, <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, uh, anyone who does want to go to England, give it a try, I mean obviously I've been here my whole life, so... Oh, of course, I'm going to say it's nothing fun, but if it's brand new for you guys, you're going to have a load of fun, trust me. There's a lot of things here in England that are actually better than people think. There's an imp right here. I'm not getting shot by it. Thank you. I don't know. I have no idea. People just shoot me left, right and centre, and half the time I don't even know where I'm getting shot, I'm getting, getting shot from, but it's, it's ridiculous. Hey, we managed to kill a scientist there, which is actually good. Thank you, everyone. I'm in your lobby. How are you? Where are you? I'm so glad someone is streaming. Thank you. Do you know the wit? <laughs> really? That was a that was a good meme to be fair. A load of people in my in my college used to say that. <laughs> Super Duke. Hello, Super Duke. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you enjoy yourself. Oh my god, why is there like Jesus? The amount of mechs there are! How am I meant to kill them by myself? Come on team. Alright, there we go. We managed to kill that one. We're gonna get this guy to level 10 quite quickly to be fair. Like I said, I, I, I did get... Oh, double kill. Level 10! Yeah, so that was the main goal for today. Like I said, I did record, like, another... Tw flipping gravity grenade. Flip off. Ow, 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 ow. Thank you. But yeah, um, I literally streamed, like, two... One second. Oh, for flip's sake, this... Honestly, this, this paleontologist, this guy is really annoying. But, um, yeah, so that was the main goal for today. I literally recorded, like, 20 minutes, half an hour stream before this one, and it glitched out. It flipping lost connection, so 
This guy was level 8 before I started playing today, and he's now level 10, so that footage you'll never see because it's just worthless, it's useless. So, I always suggest, uh, um, I don't know who to be. Let me know, like, of course, if you guys got any characters you want me to be, let me know, any characters you want me to showcase. Um, I only wanted to be uh, Agent P today to try and get him to level 10. Vampire Flower is quite close to be fair. I reckon that's a good shout. I'll, put, I'll be Vampire Flower next match, actually. I want to try and get us to level 10, maybe. Petrify Cactus. Level 1 still, but I just don't like the character. Um, I'm pretty sure it's one of those type of characters, like the Electro P Shooter. Or Electric P Shooter, where you detonate the bullet by yourself. I don't like the characters like that for some reason. I don't enjoy it. Uh, I've tried it. I've tried to get used to it. Frame requests received. Thank you. Uh, speaking of frame requests, um, of course, if you guys got any frame requests you want to send me, if you want to make, uh, if you want to add me as a friend on PlayStation, just add me right now. Um, I'm streaming pretty much every other day of the week at the moment, so uh, yeah, I'll definitely be playing games with a load of you people. I might be five P shooter. Mm, don't know. I'll, I'm kind of, I don't know who to be. Plasma P? We can give Plasma P a try, I suppose. Uh, wait, what's our reload upgrade? Yeah, we need to have that, actually. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, we're going to be Plasma P. Yeah, we're going to be Plasma P. Um, but yeah, if, like I said, if you guys got, uh, if you want to send me a friend request on PlayStation, definitely send me a friend request. Uh, I can play with you lovely, lovely people. Um, pretty often, to be fair, I'm always online. Uh, whether it's on this, whether it's on another game, anything like that. Uh, like I said, if you guys got any other games you want to play on the channel, let me know what they are. Okay, so Plasma P, I haven't been in, a, in quite some time, to be fair. I need to get used to him. Hello, uh, Gerum Zofint. <laughs> I'm terrible at noun pronunciations, name pronunciations. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, I'll try my best to try and get them right. But hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you everyone who's watching right now. We are on YouTube. Okay then, there's a lot more mech standing possible, like, than I expected. Beam bomb. I'm C21 W22. Ah, okay. I, I, that's the thing, I got an invite yesterday from a guy with that a similar name, or it was from you for Fortnite. Yo! Mate, look at his... Oh, we got... Behind us! Wait, what am I taking so long? What was I doing? I, th I think I clicked the, um... The taunt button. Why did I click that? Honestly, I forgot that I actually got, uh... I've actually got a taunt that literally takes forever to stop moving. <laughs> I need to change that because every time I click that and I'm, I'm literally standing still for like 10 seconds. Thank you everyone who's watching right now. Um, of course, if you enjoy the stream, that, honestly, if you hit the like button and subscribe, I can't thank you all enough. It's Dutch, don't try to say it, but you remember me from yesterday? Yeah, I remember you from yesterday. Um, I definitely remember you. I remember you. You was, uh, you was in my lobby, I think, as far as I remember. I, I, honestly, I'm terrible with memories. Well, excuse me, Mr. Super Brains. There we go. <laughs> it was just, I don't know what he was doing. He's just standing in front of me. It's like, yeah, come on, get the kill. Thank you for everyone who's watching right now. Playing some Garden Warfare to have takeover. Please let me know if the audio is alright. Um, I'm pretty sure it is. I, turned, I kept the volume exactly the same as it was. GC Matrix is. Ah, GC Matrix. I remember him. Yep. I remember you. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, yeah. One second, I'm going to. Oh, he, he died. Never mind. <laughs> I was about to say, I'm going to go... Oh, no, 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 no. Run away. He's got a barrel. Get away from me. Don't kill my teammate, either. Get away from me. Go. Stream sniper. Yep. <laughs> Alright, good work, Magic Viking. Magic Viking was actually in my in my lobby yesterday. Oh, my God, we've got an imp here, guys. I need help. We've got an imp. Oh, okay, Ellie Wick got him. Cheers, Ellie Wick. Being a chomper. He was in my lobby yesterday. Um, I'm not being too. I'm not doing too well with the plasma pea right now. I'm playing the fire sunflower. Ah, okay. Okay. But yeah, if you guys, like I said, if you guys ever want to play Garden Warfare 2 with me, send me a friend request. Um, that's my name on, on, uh, on YouTube and PlayStation, Curse Cockadar. Just send me a friend request on PlayStation. And yeah, I'll, I'll be able to play with you guys. I'm not feeling the plasma pea. I don't know who to be though. That's the problem. I'm not too sure who I'm in the mood for. I might be Chompa. Electro. No, I'm not being Electro P. ISP. You're not going to give Colonel Corn a try. I haven't been Colonel Corn in a long time. The last time I played as Colonel Corn was. Okay, never mind. Game over. GG, guys. But yeah, thank you everyone who's watching right now. Thank you, everyone. 
for coming over to the stream. We played some Turf Takeover or Plus vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 today. Um, Sims 4. Uh, yes, Sims 4. This is one thing I was actually meant to say at the start. Don't like the characters who you have to charge up to do damage. Yeah. There's some characters I don't like who do that. I've just mastered, like, kind of yesterday in, like, two hours. It is pretty easy. There's actually an easy way of actually levelling up your pea shooters and your Colonel Corns um, to max level quite quickly, to be fair. But, um, but, yeah, Sims 4 on the channel. Uh, for anyone who's wanted to see the Sims 4, I tried to load it up today. It was just, for some reason, it kept freezing, glitching out, pretty much doing everything you could possibly think of uh, in the bad category. So... I think it's because there's an update I actually need to do for the game. So, yeah. Anyone who's waiting for the Sims 4 on the channel, don't worry. As soon as I update the game, I'll be back on it. And that sh hopefully that is tomorrow. I should be able to stream it tomorrow if the update is done. So, anyone who's waiting for the Sims 4, don't worry. I will get around to it. I just don't want to record it and make it glitch out or anything like that. I don't want to risk it or anything because it's just going to be a pain if it does do that. So, who's your favourite character slash class? This guy right here is my favourite character on both sides, plants and zombies on both sides. This guy is my favourite character, Super Commando. A bit, uh, I used to be him a lot, and I mean a lot, a lot, a lot, during uh, the days of Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 1. Um, I used to be him a lot of times, quite a few times actually. I used to, uh, my highest kill streak with him was like 60 something, I think, like 60... 62 on Garden Warfare 1, uh, Garden Warfare 1 with Super Commando. So, if I had to pick my favourite character, definitely Super Commando, um, 100%. Always been, always love that character. He's OP, his reload speed is ridiculous, his damage is good. Um, looks like we've got quite a few people on our team right now. We've got, we've got Brian, we've got Eric, we've got Ethereal, we've got a load of people. So, yeah, being this three round person, what's your most hated character? Definitely Armour Chomper. Um, don't get me wrong, health on the Armour Chomper is amazing. On the Armour Chomper, it's, it's fantastic. You know, obviously with he like being a Chomper, you need health than that. But I feel like mainly with the Chomper, either way, if you have more health than that, you're, you're going to die, no matter what. And I think the main reason why I don't like the Armour Chomper is because the speed. I Yeah, he's slowed up. I don't like the slowness on the Chomper, or the speed on the Chomper. I just don't like it very much find it very very slow <laughs> in other words um so yeah he's probably my least favorite character the armor chomper but yeah let obviously let me know any questions um keep telling me questions i'll, I'll answer them as as best i can i'm actually gonna throw an airstrike in the middle there um gonna try my best being in this colonel corn right now i haven't been in in, in a long time um i could probably get him to max level if i wanted to but i just can't be bothered same as the corn he's so good but slow yeah I feel like the corn is like a slower version of the assault class. What's your least favourite game mode? Ooh, that's a good one. My, my favourite game mode is Turf Takeover. Uh, just purely because it's a good way of getting coins, it's long matches. Um, it, it's just a great game mode in general. It's, it's, it's a long game mode where you can just get a load of kills and everything like that. So, you know, that's probably my favourite game mode. But least favourite... Probably Gnome Bomb, it's just just purely because I haven't played much of it in my time. Um, I played it here and there to do a couple of challenges and that, but I haven't played it tons. So, where's this imp? There we go. <laughs> that guy was a flipping shrimp and then he ejected onto the <laughs> he ejected onto the roof, which is kind of funny. Um, but yeah, that's probably my least favorite game mode is Gnome Bomb, because because it's not because I don't like it or don't enjoy it. I think it's a great game mode. It's very very competitive. Very, very quick action, very fun. Um, but yeah, I think the main reason why is because I haven't played it much. That's probably the main reason why I don't like it. So, yeah. Well, look at this guy. Look, look at him. You, on this moment, I hate the uh, Team Vanquish because there's too much Shumplers and they keep reviving. Yeah, I haven't played too much Team Vanquish um, recently, but I, I can't imagine what, I, uh, what that must be like. <laughs> because the amount of Shumplers I've come up against playing any game mode and it's just frustrating if it, and if they're constantly reviving it's just so annoying. Super Duke trying to snipe me there trying to uh, kill me. Good battle though dude. We need to capture guys. Uh, I don't like Suburban Nation. Suburban Nation's mixed for me. I enjoy it but sometimes I get annoyed by it. You know it's one of those game modes I can play but I can't play it for a very long time so you know 
it kind of depends on what what mood I'm at. Like I'm in, to be fair, because if I'm in, I mean, like most of the time, I'm, I'm in. Like a uh, kill anyone? Oh no, both died. <laughs> um, yeah, it kind of depends on what mood I am. So like we got some Ellie Wick right here being a hotbot chomper. We got some sunflowers going on. There's a. Excuse me. There's a guy on top of the roof here, guys. Yeah, he's weak, he's weak, he's weak. We're going to have to try and kill him. He's literally above us. There we go, I got him. We yeah, got some flowers. Thank you for the revive. Uh, for the healing, actually. A... Okay. <laughs> Every time I literally say there's an enemy in front of us, they, they literally die within an instant. Uh, I'm just going to fire this down the middle there. Nice, got a kill. I didn't even, didn't even think I was going to get that guy there, but... Thank you everyone who's commenting right now. We're on some Garden Warfare uh, Terror Takeover. Garden Warfare 2, actually. Uh, your team are super brain scientists and the plants all, and the peas and all sunflowers and they're just sitting in pea gatlings. And, yeah, that is true. Pea gatlings are ridiculous. The only way you can pretty much get rid of them instantly is, well, probably by ZPG. I mean, you can kill them like normally and just shoot them and all that, but I just, yeah, pea gatlings are 50 50. I mean, if you're, pardon me. If you're using a P-Gatling, it is really, really fun. It, you know, it's a great way of getting kills and that. But if you're facing a P-Gatling, it's not fun. Especially if they, if, especially if you can't kill them. So, I've got another friend request. Thank you for sending me a friend request. Um, I believe it was KSJD2 Shetland on the zombie side. Thank you so much. We won 10 kills. We've actually got most kills apart from one guy. <laughs> I literally saw the number 11 at the last second. We've got some Pharaoh here. Thea, 12. Looking uh, looking great. To be fair, I've actually got some Pharaoh, some Flower, uh, max level. Kind of surprising. Uh, do you have any characters with all abilities changed? Um, yeah, I've got quite a few characters with the abilities changed. I try and change them as much as I can. I normally change them to the ones that I prefer, which is, you know, just normal common sense. If I don't enjoy the ability, like, for example, the Foot Soldier with the Rocket Leap. I think it's the Rocket Leap, if not the... Uh, the leap, no, the rocket leap that goes forward instead of upwards. I like using them both, but it kind of depends on what like map I'm on. I mean, if it's one with like high places and rooftops like this one, it's going to be the one that jumps upwards. Um, there we go, managed to get killed there. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> Who do you think is the best scientist? Me, personally, I love... Astronaut. The astronaut scientist is OP. It is ridiculous. If any of you, if any of you haven't used the astronaut, definitely use him. I definitely recommend him. I think the main reason why I love the astronaut so much is because the rate of fire, for starters, is ridiculous. It shoots. Like, there you go. Up here. This guy shooting at me on top of this roof right now is an astronaut. It is really, really OP, the rate of fire, the damage, the range, the reload speed, it literally is perfect for me. I love it. It is OP as anything. Um, choose an ability that can be nerfed and then it can be buffed. Uh, hmm. I, don't really, I don't really pay attention to abilities that much, to be fair. I mean, if I don't, if I don't enjoy them much, I mean, let me know, let me know what your favourite abilities are. That's one question for you guys in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section. Chemist is... Pretty OP, you just gotta be right next to him, unfortunately. This guy, I bet it's Super Duke, isn't it? It's, it's, this guy's Super Duke, I bet you are. He keeps trying to shoot me right now. There you go, I managed to shoot him. Throw, throw one of these up there, actually, that's a good idea. Tackle. Tackle, yeah. I don't, to be fair, I'm not gonna lie, I don't use um, All Star much. Yeah, Super Duke, Master, see? I've got, um, as far as I remember, I've actually got the astronaut max level myself, so. Super Duke has definitely got the right idea, being the astronaut. He's one of my favourite scientists. I never, to be completely honest with you, I never used to be a scientist at all, really, on Garden Warfare 1. I never was him... I, I, I never was that character a lot. Whereas now, on Garden Warfare 2, I've used him a lot more, and I've literally is one of my favourite characters. Um, so, you know, I feel like, in a, in a good way, this game has opened up a load of new characters. Uh, which is really, really good. And it gives people new ways of exploring, you know, new ways of killing people, uh, killing zombies and that, new ways, new zombies as well. Scuba Soldier, for this guy right in front of me, actually. Hello. <laughs> I don't know where he went. 
I killed him, <laughs> but let me guess who killed me. Oh no, he killed me, it's MPG. So I shuck shotted him, I killed him, then he's MPG me at the same time. I think the husk cop is, uh, is too OP. It is OP, um, especially when there's like three or four people, maybe five, six people in one place and you just jump over them and use it. It pretty much rinses their health. It literally it is one of the best abilities. Uh, blur. One of the best abilities I've ever used on Garden Warfare in general. I actually made it to leaderboard, which is surprising. Nine, nine bank, uh, nine bank of sugar, Is that it? I can't kill anything with it. Yeah, I. It's one of those abilities that you know. Sometimes I kill with it. Sometimes I don't. <laughs> you know. But yeah, thank you everyone who's watching right now. We're a load of people watching. Thank you so much for everyone who's watching right now on the stream. Playing some turf takeover today on the. Uh, on Guardians and Graveyard. Thank you everyone who's actually came over to the stream, said hello, asked me a couple of questions. Assist Master. Hey, well done, bro. How many assists did you get? 13. Flipping hell, and you only got two kills, mate. That would annoy me. This is that, that kind of thing annoys me. Whenever I get like a load of assists, but I get like three or four kills, I'm just like, 13 of those kills should have been mine, <laughs> but you know, it is what it is. But yeah, thank you everyone who's watching right now. We are playing some Garden. Guardians and Graveyards, having a good time. Um, so, of course, you you need you never kill anything and, and this game is only assist. Yeah, very annoying, but meh. Yeah, I agree, it is annoying, but, you know, it is what it is. So, I mean, getting a boast on this is actually pretty cool. So, we're actually pushing on this team now. We're being zombies and seeds of time. Um, here's a question for you guys. If you could pick a favourite map, Garden Warfare 2, what map would it be and why? What map is your favourite on this game? All right. Yeah, I've got astronaut back, so that's what I thought I did. But yeah, what is your favourite map on Garden Warfare 2? It could be anything. Um, me, personally, I do like Seeds of Time, um, but I also like Great White North. Can I join you later? Uh, I need to eat first. Yeah, sure, you can join me later. Um, I might be on later on. Uh, I'm more likely will to be there because I ain't doing anything today. <laughs> like usually, like usual. But, um, but yeah, so let me know what your favourite map is. I like Great White North and Seas of Time, so this one and Great White North, it's probably my two favourite maps. So, let me know what your favourite maps are. Mate, like, what is this chomping? Excuse me. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought you were going to pop out of the ground and try and kill the uh, engineer, but... Sorry, was... oh, are you serious? I thought it was a leap. Never mind. <laughs> I hate Seas I hate Seas of Time, I played it too much. That is, that is true. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of, oh god, Huscop. Speaking of Huscop, this, this guy's trying to Huscop me. <laughs> to be fair, I should actually be in a, uh, a tall place with this guy. I need to snipe. So what I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to I'm gonna jump up here. Uh, three, two, one. As if someone killed me with the, the P Gatlin from that range, or from that place. Look, we've got a... Uh, K K two J right now, right in front of me being all star. So that's one character. I, like, I I have different opinions on different characters. You know, like all stars, 50-50. I use them sometimes. I sometimes don't. Um, Team Vanquish, Zen Peak, Turf Takeover, Great White North. Yeah, Great White North is one of my favourites. I do like it. I don't know what it is about the map, but I just really enjoy it. So uh, I feel like it. I feel like the main reason why I enjoy it is because mainly. Um, Oh, sorry, I watched YouTube. That's fine. I just got a message from one of the people I met on stream. I literally just killed that guy with his APG somehow. I think I got him. I think he was in the garlic zone, that's why. Um, I think this guy down here trying to... Excuse me. Mr. Barbecue Corn, whatever your name is. I'm actually on fire. I need to move on. There we go. <laughs> I had a bottle of water in front of my in front of my health. I couldn't see where... There we go. ZPG. I'm probably going to die. No, no, no. Never mind. Wait, what? Oh, you, you, fire damage. Honestly, fire damage on this game is ridiculous. One of my favourites, if I'm completely honest. It is my favourite element. But yeah, thank you everyone who's watching right now. We are playing some Turf Takeover. We're in Seeds of Time. Uh, Eliwick, 17, has got 7 kills. Uh, BG Raven, being pretty sure. Friend Request to see you, Super Duke. Uh, yeah, speaking of friend requests, anyone who sends me a friend request, um, I will accept them all after the stream. Because if I do it during the stream, it's going to cut off the stream, going to disconnect and all that, and then I have to reload it and that. So I will accept the friend request, don't worry, we'll get around to it after the stream. So 
if you have good enemies, it's almost impossible to get the last object of the uh, time. Yeah, that is true. The, la the last, um, the last one where you have to push the the boat uh, with the. <laughs> uh, yeah, the the castle, um, the castle setting. Whenever you, when, at the end of this one, we have to push the boot. Um, yeah, I would probably say it's one of the hardest ones to do. But quite frankly, the hardest, like final thing, like final event I had to do on any map before is probably Zombopolis, where you have to take down the robot. Uh, what the? There we go. Behind us, the Citroen. Ah, oh, this guy again. BG Raven, P Cannon. He's actually using a normal P Cannon. What level was he? Oh, he's only level 36. That is. Wow. I don't even remember being that. I hate Zombopolis. Yeah, it's pop. Zombopolis is probably my least favourite level. Yo, dude. Yeah, Zombopolis is my least favourite level because A, played it way too many times, and B, I just. I don't know. It's, I just find it boring. Like, I don't think it's. I hate the final objective. Yeah. New followers, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Oh, God. I need healing. Anybody a scientist? Oh my god, what the flip? Get out of here, you stupid chomper. I can't even see him. I don't even know what's going on. There we go, killed, killed that sunflower. That actually scared me. I hate the final objective on, on Moon Point Z. What's the... Oh yeah, it's that... Oh, Moon Point Z, that's the, um, that's the one where you have to score goals, don't you? It's like a football match or something like that. With, uh, both teams have to try and push the balls into the goal. Um... I don't mind that one. A bit of a 50-50 with that. I mean, sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't, but yeah. Certain maps I enjoy, certain maps I don't, so, you know, it's just, the kind of, it just doesn't really change for me. I mean, I've always, I, I never got into Zombopolis. I never enjoyed it. I don't know what it is. I just don't think it's a good map, in my opinion, but some people might enjoy it more than me, so. There's a, there's a chomp, no, it's not. I thought there was a chomper behind me there for a second, but it turns out I was wrong. I don't think these guys actually know I'm actually over here, which is kind of kind of interesting because I'm actually on the side part right here. Um, there we go. Get rid of, get rid of Sun Pharaoh, Mr. Sun Pharaoh. There we go. Throw a smoke grenade in actually. Nice ZPG shot, dude. Thank you. I'm not too bad with his ZPG. Um, I can be terrible with it, so hopefully it never comes to that point. I mean, that shot right there, one damage. Seriously. <laughs> you might as well not give me the damage at all if it's only one damage. I need to get some high grounds. Here we go. It's not a bad spot. There's a, there's a Citron there, guys. We're going to have to try and kill him. We're trying to revive. Uh, we'll capture him, which is good. Oh, flip's sake. I always fall off for that. Every time. Hey, we've got P. Gatling, guys. We're going to have to try and take him down. There we go. Every little helps. That is true. One 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 percent damage does help. I mean, that that it's one less guy to worry about, I suppose. That's how I look at it sometimes. But yeah, thank you everyone who's watching. By the way, I really really appreciate it. It's actually, it's like honestly, I don't know what it is, but every time I stream Garden Warfare 2, Plants vs Zombies, the support is amazing. Honestly, it's so many people come over to my stream, say hello, ask me questions. It, it's honestly fantastic. Oh, <laughs> RT Gamer. Mate, this guy is really good with his character, a paleontologist, being a dinosaur. Look at that hat, it looks amazing. But yeah, honestly, it's the support whenever I do this game is amazing. Like, so thank you everyone who's ever came over to my stream, said hello or anything like that. I hate with this RPG and shot shot, because you need to direct hit someone to kill them, otherwise you do one damage. That is, yeah, that is true. Um, that's always been the case, in my opinion, you have to direct hit them. Uh, but, uh, again, okay. <laughs> that's the thing, if think about it if they did change that if they what the no 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 there we go if they did change this RPG in the shock shot to the point where you can do a load of damage by not direct hitting them but hitting it next to them that is pretty op if you ask me that is op in my opinion that is ridiculous shot ah oh, come on i'm gonna shoot that down there for a second i'm gonna put that in the middle but yeah, that is that would be broken if they did change this RPG because I reckon it would be a lot worse if they done that. Because as much as you don't get as many kills with this RPG and that, I do feel like if they added like splash damage, like good splash damage with it, it would just be way too overpowered and it's just be hard to try and avoid, you know? Because people would just shoot them as soon as they get the ability, they would just shoot it straight at you. So 
the one thing I do like, uh, don't like about the game is the balancing. Yeah, balancing. Depends what kind of balancing you're talking about, though. It's like the the levels between the different people. Um, one time I was uh, with this other players, two versus four. Actually, yeah, the, the amount of people on both teams. Yeah, that is true. Because look, we're the pineapple. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> By the way, the reason why I said pineapple, because the guy at the bottom of their team has a, has a name in pineapple, but yeah, the different balancing in the teams uh, regarding the amount of people either side, yeah. They did it with like spicing range or in punt, or it's not OP, but if they didn't, uh, in some cases, it's useless. Yeah, that is true. That's the thing. Do you reckon they're going to change anything major in the Garden Warfare 3 game when it comes out? I reckon they're going to change anything, they're going to get rid of any characters. To be fair, I actually created one of my own characters, um, a mushroom character for the plant team, because we haven't got any mushroom characters. And it actually got liked and retweeted on the uh, on their website, uh, on, on Twitter, so, uh, by PopCap, which is awesome. I mean, I'm a huge fan of PopCap. I love their games. It's probably main game is obviously Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. Uh, or Plants vs. Zombies franchise in general. Um, fantastic, so... Wait, are they releasing a the third game? I don't know. Um, as far as I remember, I was on Twitter a while ago, and one of the uh, developers actually retweet, uh, like, tweeted out a kind of a teaser for Garden Warfare 3. Don't know how true it was, but, you know, keep an eye out. It could happen. I can get rid of these fox right here. Me and Chemist are actually doing really well. Oh no 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 no! Why are? One second, guys. I'll read the comments in a minute. I'm just trying to focus right now. Mate, the amount of pots they've got. Jesus. On a rate of one to t one to ten, how high do you rate Torchwood? Hmm. I mean, Torchwood. Not. I don't know. I'll come back to that in a second. If they do want them to use the maps for the first game. Yeah, the maps, I, f I don't know what it is. I feel like the first maps that came out of Garden Warfare 1, like all the maps on that game, like Jewel Junction and Walnut Hills or Walnut Mansion and stuff like that, I just felt like I remember them more. Like, not in a horrible way or like, oh, these maps suck kind of way. I don't know what it is. I feel like, I, don't, I just don't know what it is. I feel like uh, Garden Warfare 1 had more of an impact than this game on me, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I would like to see them bring back a couple of classic maps, uh, to be fair. Yeah, um, rate of 1 to 10, how hard do you rate Torchwood? Uh, Torchwood. Kind of depends. Um, he's a brand new character, obviously, Seeker, I think they were better. Yeah, I think the maps were better. Um, yeah, Torchwood, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like he's like a 6 or a 7. I would rate him 10, 100%. Uh, probably like a 6 or 7, maybe 8, if I'm pushing it a little bit. He's a good character, don't get me wrong, but he's... I don't know what it is. Um, something about him, I just don't enjoy it. Whereas, I, don't know what it I don't know what it is, but I do like him. I, just a couple of things, I don't know why I hate him, but I just don't enjoy him as much as other characters. So, yeah. Let me know what you guys think about Torchwood. Also, let me know what you think about the Hover Goat as well. Uh, Hover Goat would be... I feel like Hover Goat is actually pretty interesting. You know, it's a brand new character, Astronaut. See, look, my man has the idea. Look, he's being astronaut. He's actually loving it. Um, yeah, astronaut. Astronaut? <laughs> the hover goat, I reckon, was interesting. Because Torchwood, you know, we've seen him before type of thing. We've seen him in um, Plants vs. Zombies 2 on the phone, on the mobile. Um, get rid of that guy. There we go. Um, but, yeah, the hover goat, I felt like it was more fun. Like, you can use him... Obviously, they're completely different characters. Like, Torchwood is a tank, and then obviously. One second, this guy's gonna try and kill me. Wait, where's this guy going? There we go. But yeah, Torchwood is a tank, and obviously, Hover Goat is like a. I feel like Hover Goat is like a. a tiny. It's like a bigger version of an imp. It's like a pretty. A, like, pretty quick. He's. Quick, easy damage, not too overpowered, you know, something like that. There you go, killed him, he killed me, sorted. <laughs> not, I'm actually going to get this guy to level 10, uh, might as well. Oh, thank you for the revive, I appreciate it. There's actually um, quite a few characters down here, lightweight, yeah, he's lightweight, which I feel like we need more of in this game. 
because we got some, you know, Torture is like a, a mech for the plants, so if you want him to play him, you're going to get uh, double teamed so many times, because you're always, yeah, that is true. You're going to get, no matter how many times you play as Torture, no matter who you're playing against, you're going to get double teamed with Torture. Um, 100%. It, it's not really a no-brainer. You are going to get killed a lot with Torture. Um, 100%. So, you know, he's one of those characters, I don't have a strong opinion on him, but I, I do give him a chance whenever I, I want to play as him. Nine out of ten times, I do enjoy him because obviously he's a new character. I want to give him a try. I want to give him a give him a uh, give him a go. Wait, how did I not hit him? Excuse me, Mr. Sunflower, over there, <laughs> hiding around the corner. There you go, he's gone. Thank you, everyone who's watching right now. Fifty-three comments and seven people watching. Thank you, everyone who's watching. This is absolutely amazing. Wait, wait, Mr. Chomper, get out! Oh no, 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 no! Get away from him. Go that guy. Get rid of him. There we go. Boing, shoot you. I'll go revive. And he's big, so it's easy to shoot a ZPG in him. Yeah, that is true. ZPG, um, it's like uh, when you shoot a. Well, to be fair, I haven't actually done it much, but it's like when you shoot a ZPG at a Z mech. It, it's like they're such a big of a target, it's actually pretty easy to kill them. Imp punt is easy, yeah. Imp punt, I love using. Especially when, like, you get, like, a. Like a double or triple kill with it. It's like a, it's like an, a zombie version of a chili bean bomb, in my opinion. It, um, it's, it's actually really good damage. There you go, Mr. Chomper. He wants you to die and then I killed you. <laughs> oh, yo, dude, mate, he's being a zoologist. To be fair, that is actually one character I need to be. Um, I've actually prestiged him. Uh, he's level one. Look at all of us. Look, we've got two electro brains. We've got some zoologist action, we've got an engineer, we've got a stenchy the skunk, we've got a, another all-star. You know, this is, like I said, every time I play this game, I love it. It's just so much fun. I have the flying imp, so I can't, I can't use the close range or use exclusive bosses. Yeah. Can I join you? Uh, yes, you can. You can join me. Um, I can't actually send you a friend request, because if I do, it's going to mess up the stream or anything like that. But just in case. I don't think it does, but just in case. If it does, I don't really want to quit out the stream or anything like that. So try and join my game if you can. Um, but yeah, speaking of joining my game, send me a friend request on PlayStation. Uh, of course, like I said, I play a load of different games. If you guys got any other games you want me to play, let me know what they are in the comment section below. Thank you everyone who's watching right now. This is absolutely awesome to know that you guys are loving this game. I'm loving this game. What the? Excuse me, Mr. Sunflower. Get away from there, please. Stop shooting us. You are miles away. <laughs> actually got him, <laughs> but you need to go back to uh, before I can join you. Okay, so yeah, after this game, we're gonna go back to back uh, back your battleground. So, anyone who wants to, one second, there we go. Anyone who wants to join my game, send send me a friend request right now, and then I can send you a invite to my lobby uh, in a minute. So, I wish I could join you. Yeah, I mean, if your battery's low, doesn't matter, dude. Doesn't matter if you don't join me. I mean, you joining the stream is awesome enough. Like, you don't have to play the game with me. I mean, I love you guys no matter what. So, Bing Bomb, fire! That was a terrible ZPG. <laughs> well, hello, Mister Mister Citron. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I'm actually gonna. Is there a way I can go around? Oh, no, I can't. All right. I'm gonna throw friend request for C. Thank you. Um, but yeah, like I said, friend request. I will accept everyone's friend request after the stream. To make it easier for me, so hello, Mr. Barbecue Corn. See what I mean? Husk Cop. Whoever said Husk Cop is OP, you're 100% correct. <laughs> Husk Cop is ridiculous. There we go, managed to kill him. Excuse me, Mr. Wait, what? BG Raven with the hot rod. Come on, man. Who is your who who is the best imp in your opinion? <sighs> Not gonna lie, I don't really use imp much. Um, yeah, I've used him once or twice. I'm just gonna kill this guy; he's been a pain. Um, but if I had to choose, probably shrimp imp. I don't know. Like I said, I wish I could actually answer that question with a better answer, but I don't really use imp much. Um, just too weak in my opinion. So. Who is your favourite imp? Let me know that. Do you have the Deluxe Edition? Uh, I do on my other account. Um, but not on this one. That makes sense. Because uh, I made a stupid mistake. 
when buying it. Uh, it turns out you actually have to like buy it on a account with PlayStation Plus because uh, something like that. I don't know. But I managed to buy it on that account, and then it turns out it didn't transfer over to this one, which is kind of annoying. So I technically do have it, but not on my main account, which is this one. So. Excuse me, barbecue corn. Thank you. And you're dead. I'm actually going to go over to the right hand side. I'm going to try and do the levers, actually. Oh my god, that, that was close. This so we got an uh, astronaut with me. Oh, we got a. Uh... Pardon me. But yeah, hey, we've got uh, quite a few people over here, actually. Gonna, don't worry, bro. I've got you. I joined you. All right, cool. Oh no, 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 no. Never mind. <laughs> but yeah, thank you, everyone, who's commented. 62 comments. The other day we managed to hit 100 comments, which is flipping amazing. It's incredible to know you guys are interacting and having a good time. Hopefully, so thank you, everyone, who's came over to the stream. Really, really appreciate it. Doing this is a load of fun though, meeting you guys. I know every YouTuber says it, but meeting you guys is honestly the best thing about YouTube. It's just meeting new people and just meeting people who have the same interests as you. That's the best thing I could, that's, the, that's like the best way I could say it. It's like one of the best things. One second, got to kill this guy. Oh, he's going to kill me instead. But yeah, honestly, thank you everyone who's ever came over to my channel. Um, I never thought I'd do this well, like meeting all of you people and all that. I honestly, literally, just, all I do, the only reason why I do this is to have a good time. It's a hobby, you know, I enjoy it. And if it benefits and if, if it pays off, then thank you everyone who, who helps me do that. So, thank you. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Colonel Corn. Mr. Barbecue Corn, whatever your name is. Get away from me, please. Thank you. Gonna throw that over there. Gonna throw that over there. Thank you. Uh, never mind. Wait, who is I getting shot by? Oh, I mean, Baby Corn Bust. That's a legendary character, I think. Unless I'm going crazy. Yeah, GC Matrix. He's on the plant team. Thank you for joining. Yeah, I'll probably play probably play another game after this, yeah. I'll we'll play another game after this. I want to try, I want to hopefully do uh, Moonbase Z. That's one of my favourite maps to be fair, just purely because of the low gravity zone. Come on. You got, come on, most of you got agreement on that. The reason why we all like... Don't even try it, dude. I was way ahead of you there. One second. Okay, never mind. Um, but yeah, all right, come on, you got to agree with me on that. The main reason why we like Moonbase Z is because of the low gravity. Come on, does anyone else does anyone else think that apart from me? Because low gravity, I think, is actually pretty cool. Like it's actually what would happen in real life. It would have if it happened in real life, which it wouldn't. Super Brain is uh, Moonbase is OP. Never been Super Brains much. Um, obviously been Toxic Brains, Electro Brains every now and again, but not one of my favourite characters. I'm not too sure how the melee thing kind of works in this game. Yeah, you have Chomper, but. I don't know about Super Brains. Like, Chompa, I enjoy using. I just think it's one of those characters, you know... I don't know. If, Chompa, in my opinion, is better than Super Brains at melee. So, let me know what you, what your favourite is. Chompa, Super Brains. Sure choice. I prefer Chompa, if I'm honest. 57 kills, BG Raven. KSJ D2 Shetland with the, with, with the healings as well. Look at how many kind of corners are uh, on plants. Yeah, thank you, everyone who's joined the game. 28 kills. I, I actually did a lot better there than expected, which is actually pretty cool. Which is good. RT Gamer with the with the uh, 23. No, uh, RT Gamer with the full 57. That's good. That. GC Matrix. Super Duke with the um, 31 kills. Good kills there, dude. Good kills. Thank you everyone who's commenting by the way, coming over, saying hello, let me know what your favourite colour is. Literally, we just talk about anything in this chat. I literally don't even mind. Seeds of time again. Ah, uh, come on. Kind of annoying whenever you play the same map over and over again, but, you know. Wait, who are we? Yeah, I'm going to be, yeah. 
I'm gonna be in this character again. I want to try and get to level ten. That's my. That's another goal that I want to get to. Pretty small games, to be fair. There we go. RT gamer and super joke on my team. I hate when. Uh, I hate when they do that. Yeah. I hate when they do that as well. You know, you want to play other maps. I don't like playing the same map over and over again. What the f- Mate, that guy just got ruined. <laughs> I sent you a friend message. Alright, thank you for the notification, dude. Like I said, friend request and that. If you guys send me a friend request, I will I will accept it after this stream. Um, it's easier for me to do that. Otherwise, it's going to you know quit out of the game and all that. So... Oh my god, there's a chomper. There's two chompers. There you go. <laughs> I'm actually getting shot from behind here. This is not good. Ow. Don't even change the side which you are on. Yeah, that is true. Oh my god. There we go. Okay. What is this chomper doing? Leave the zombie alone. What's he done to you? Well, you can try and burrow me, mate, but I've got uh, something called a little bit of a leap, which I can try and use. There we go. <laughs> it makes me laugh whenever they do that. They think they're so smart going underneath the ground, and then you're just like, yep, yeah, click triangle, and go on top of a roof. <laughs> Honestly, they, 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 they think they're so good, and it's, it's really funny to be fair. So honestly, it's amazing, like, on any game you play, you, you've got to agree with me on this, all the gamers out there, you've got to agree with me on this. Whenever you come across someone who's on a kill streak, or someone who's, you know, who, like, someone who you know is trying their best, absolute best, to try and... To try and, um, try and beat you, or something like that. It is so good whenever you kill them. It's so satisfying. <laughs> What is going on? I have no idea what's going on, but five people watching the stream. Thank you, everyone, uh, who's watching right now. Like I said, if you've got any games you want me to play on the channel, let me know in the comment section below. Any other video ideas, uh, vlogs, day in the life stuff, let me know. Um, I could try my best to get around to them. They're probably not my main priority, because obviously this, game, uh, this channel is all about gaming, but... <coughs> Excuse me. If you do, if you do want to see some vlogs and that, I suppose I can try and do some. It's just like I said yesterday's stream. If, uh, for those who didn't watch it, the main reason why I don't do vlogs and that is because you don't know what to say in the vlogs and it gets boring, repetitive, and stuff like that. So, if you guys got any ideas for the channel, let me know. Is that a chomper? Oh no, sir. <laughs> I thought that was a chomper underneath me then, <laughs> being an all star. Pretty cool, man. All stars are not my favourite. I mean, I use them. My favourite all star, probably golf star. The golf, is it golf star that has the quick rate of fire, or am I going crazy? I think it is. I think it is the all star golf star with the rate of fire. I'm not too sure. Let me correct me on that one. But I think it is golf star with the rate of fire. I'm not too sure. I don't think we've got any engineers on the team actually. I might, I might be an engineer after this game. If I get this guy to level ten, I might be an engineer because uh, you know the. Uh, teleport in these building and that it helps out all right teleport does help <laughs> quite a bit to be fair Oh you fluff nugget don't ask I there we go <laughs> I managed to kill him anyway, but No, 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 Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone Never mind. <laughs> what do you think about uh, the engineer change from the bolt to the bar, uh, from the bot to the bolt blaster? That is interesting because uh, obviously in Garden Warfare One, engineer used to be uh, well was able to use like a little garlic drone zombie version. It's like a little drone that you can fly around, shoot people, airstrike, and that. And they changed it to the big bolt blaster. Now I don't know. I feel like it was interesting. To see how they changed that ability to the Big Bob Blaster and gave the um, ability to the pirate, which I think is kind of a better move because obviously Sniper Cactus with the drone kept it like that, and Engineer isn't really a sniper, in my opinion. It's not a sniper, it's not a sniper class. So obviously they bring out the pirate class, which is a sniper class, and they gave it the drone, which 
it's understandable. So I feel like it was a good move on their behalf, bringing out new character and adding that ability to that character. So yeah, I reckon it was a good idea, to be fair. Go away, leave me alone. <laughs> Guy's shooting at me with Rock P Shooter. Thank you, RT Gamer, being the uh, archaeologist. Look at that orbital cube on his head. We've got Turbo Games, 3-2-1, being uh, normal Super Brains. He's got a helmet on him. But yeah, um, let me pause it here for a second. Speaking of the different characters, Super Duke, what's up, man? Um, yeah, I reckon it was a good move on their behalf. Because obviously, like I said, uh, bringing out the brand new sniper class, you want them to have like another ability. And you probably find they didn't know what to do with the abilities and that. Because obviously they bring out the Lucy Barrel Blast, which obviously with the pirate is actually pretty cool. Then you've got the cannon, which is pretty cool. And then obviously, they probably, you probably find they didn't know, they didn't have another idea for the other abilities. So they were like, okay, we've got an idea for the engineer, so let's get rid of this ability for the engineer. Put this ability on it and put that um, taking away ability on the on the sniper class. So that makes sense. I probably explain that in the worst way possible, but that's my opinion. I think it was a good idea for them to do that. Um, yeah. So how are we doing anyway? We have got nine kills, not too bad. Super Duke got six. Leveling up slowly but surely. Nearly got this guy to level ten. Uh, RT Gamer twelve kills, the top of leaderboards again. Uh, B BG Red Pineapple, <laughs> we've got Turbo Games, we've got Furious, we've got BG Red Pineapple, uh, MLG, NL, yeah, we've got a load of different people on our team. There's BG Pineapple, look at his hair, it looks amazing, very, very cool. Fire! Fire that ZPG down there, did nothing at all, as always. <laughs> Just gonna try and kill this pea shooter down here. There we go. Sorry, dude, but you was in the way of... Uh, wait, was there cactus on the right? Yeah, there's a cactus on the right-hand side. Anybody who's going to go down the secret pathway where the boulder is, like the gigantic boulder, uh, there's a cactus sitting over there. Um, he's just sitting up in a window where the boulder is. So if anyone can try and kill him, that'd be great. Because he's going to try and snipe everybody from that angle. Quite a smoke grenade over there. In your opinion, uh, what's making the background backgrounds a good or bad thing? Uh, I reckon it was kind of cool, to be fair. Uh, it, was, it was interesting, because it's like a, it like a pre-lobby kind of thing. Like on, um, it's completely different games, I know, but it's like on Fortnite and H1Z1. Other games I do play, by the way. Uh, it's like a pre-game lobby. Like, you can wait around, you can do little bits, and I think it was cool, because... It's not only like a pre-game level where you can wait for your matches and that. You can also invite your friends. You can do quests um, and all that. So I think it was pretty cool. I think it was a good idea, but you don't. Uh, but you, uh, you need to leave it to do anything. Yeah. So yeah, I feel like they could have made it better, but um, yeah, I think it was a good idea adding it because it made it, it made the game slightly better. So. How, I need to get rid of this garlic drone, which is actually pretty annoying. Wait, what? How did I not kill him? These garlic drones are flipping annoying. Ah, uh, flip that guy. Where's... There we go, killed the cactus drone. <laughs> garlic drone. Oh, yeah, that's the thing. That, wasn't it called garlic drone before? And they changed it to cactus drone. Something like that. I don't know what they've done, but they changed it. I could have swear they did. Come on, guys, let's capture. Oh no, I'm getting killed. I'm gonna get. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh mate. <sighs> Again, it was called Garlic Drone. Yeah, I thought it was. I thought I was going crazy there for a second, but I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I played way too much of Garden Warfare One to a like. Like I said, I played a lot of Garden Warfare 1. I feel like I played it a lot more than this. Um, my playtime on it, pff, no idea. Can't even remember. But, um, yeah, I played a lot more Garden Warfare 1 than this one for some reason. I feel like, I feel like, I think it was because it was like, you know, it's the very first Garden Warfare game, you know. It's something brand new, and then obviously they bring it out like this. And this one, they've added some new game modes, new challenges, new characters. You know, it's like a... Big DLC, in other words. Um, 
I'm actually going to try and get in here and capture because nobody's capturing right now. We have to try and capture, guys. I'm getting slowed down. I need help. Somebody help me. I'm trying to capture the zone and I'm getting killed by sunflowers and that here. 12 kills. I think that's, I think that's game over. Yeah, this game over. GG, guys. They got rid of the, the Taco game mode. Wait, was it that Taco Bandits? Something like that. Taco Bandits? I think, it, I think it was called that. But yeah, I completely forgot about that game mode. I remember... Who remembers on Garden Warfare 1 on the channel? Let me know if you remember this in the comment section. If you remember when they bring out the Tactical Kook... Uh, ta tactical Cucumber uh, map. And it was like... They got rid of it because there was like a massive glitch in that map. Or something like that. It was so funny. It was so funny because the map people were like, Oh, what's happened to the map? You got rid of it. And all that. There's people talking to me. Hello? Quite a few people on their team. It's, um, quite a few people actually. Yo, dude. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Alright, we'll put those guys on mute because uh, I love the guys. Ah, uh, Zombopolis. Of course it's a Zombopolis. I mean, why would it be another map that I like? You know, I'm actually... I played this last game, and then I'm going to... I'm going to go back to Backyard Battleground, because I'm hoping... Wait, did I get this guy to level 10 yet? No, we're, we're close. Okay, so we're going to get this guy to level 10, uh, this match, and then we're going to go back to Backyard Battleground and try and... Uh, try and prestige this guy, so... Yeah, that's the plan. That's what we're going to do. Uh, and then hopefully, when we go back into some more turf takeover, we're going to find a bigger lobby. So, thank you, everyone, who's watching right now. Seventy-six comments. That is amazing. Thank you, everybody, uh, for coming over to the stream, saying hello, asking me some questions. First kill of the game. ZPG. GC Matrix being the, uh, the goo blaster. My man, helping me out there. We've got another sunflower here. There we go. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get rid of Sky. There we go. Nice. As long as we just spawn trap these guys, we can. Like, okay, we've got a bigger lobby now. We've got a more even game. Oh my god, where did this guy come from? One second. Just gonna kill that guy. There we go. Oh my god. Never mind. <laughs> I remember that map. Yeah, I remember that. Tactical, tactical cucumber. I forgot what the actual map's called. Is it like Main Street or something like that? I don't remember. But I remember that map with the giant rocket at the end of it, and there was a massive glitch in the game, and they got rid of it. Good times, to be fair. Good times. One thing I remember mostly about Garden Warfare 1, though, is when the DLCs came out, and they bring out, uh, I think it was Jewel Junction, for Team Vanquish and that. I remember that map a lot, because there was a lot of teasers dropped on, their, on uh, the developers' um, Twitter accounts about the uh, Jewel Junction DLC. Then... What map did they bring out for the for the uh, other DLC? I think it was I can't remember the name of it, but wasn't there a map where you had to push in like a golf ball in like the into the golf hole or something like that? At least they put a tactical uh, tactical coup epic customization. Yeah, I reckon that's a good idea. Get rid of the map, make it a customization. <laughs> Yeah, am I going crazy? Or I think there was a map where there was a golf ball or something like that. Yeah, there was. Yeah. Um, how am I remembering this stuff? I have no idea. I don't even remember what I had for breakfast this morning. <laughs> Sunflower over here. Killing all my teammates. There's actually a lot of sunflowers on their team, to be fair. Which is not good. We need to try and kill them. Thank you everyone who's watching. Nearly got 80 comments. If we can hit 100 comments today's stream, like the other stream the other day, that would be insane. What the? Jesus, that scared me. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I get like shot like three different directions. But yeah, if we can hit 100 comments, that'd be amazing. I can't thank you all enough. Well, coming over. Shine your support as always. 
Uh, I also want to thank you all for the support on my game clip videos. Um, I don't only do streams, I do like extra game clips and stuff like that. Uh, sometimes some good kills, sometimes just some normal kills and stuff like that. Nothing too crazy. Um, but yeah, thank you everyone who watches them. I do loads of different games on them. I do pretty much every other game I play to be fair. 